Hello and welcome back again, my friend, to the SP500 index fund analysis, the Nasdaq 100 analysis, the DXY or US dollar index analysis, plus the Bitcoin price prediction. This is Thomas with you again, guys. We came back in another video. So, if it's the first time of you here, you watching me now, make sure to subscribe to our channel and turn the bell notification on to receive all our latest updates and videos. And if you be a subscriber with us, make sure to smash that like button down, write down a comment, support us guys. You done it. Thank you very, very, very much, my friend. Now let's start our lesson of today, guys. So as you see, guys, here, the SP500 here, what it's trying to give us here. If you make a close eye with me here like that and like that, it give you here a head and shoulder here. Why? That pushing up happening today because the jobless claim we came today majority of stocks of usa microsoft to me i'm talking about blue chips microsoft google amazon all those ones they are today green and that's what it's showing even here in the sp500 it's showing uh, it's a green day today so that's a good news for us market but don't forget guys one thing very 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 important today is friday guys and friday is the last day of 2022 so maybe that one is just a trap guys so if there is a breakout up it's going to happen till monday so don't enter today and came in monday and blaming me because i know some people they came to blame me blah 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 about something but those people majority of them they don't watch in the video from the start till the end those ones they try to get the information very quick that we're making the mistakes you if you're watching the video from the start till the end you will get the information the right way how us we tell it to you because us we tell you long but we tell you with condition we tell you short and we tell you with condition that's another story so now here as i told you guys it tried to give us here a head and shoulder here as you see it but here the condition what is it for us to enter you came here look with me very 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 careful you came here you draw it like that you change it from candles to lines and you came here to that place here and you draw in there a line that the neckline you need a candle to start it here and to close above here me i'm talking about some people they know what they're doing if you don't know what you're doing i just want a candle to start down here and to close above here it needs to be a green candle like that to close here to close here the open of the candle it needs to be down and the close it needs to be up for you to enter long everything is too clear so now you got here a head and shoulder the neckline look at it where it is here if a candle came like that and close here if it close here you enter long if it doesn't there is no injury and also where we enter short we enter from here the break will happen here exactly guys it came down here we're taking some of the profit now if that break of that head and shoulder happen here we will close all the short position and we will open a buy position guys everything is very simple why all that guys because us here because now us we are not talking about news or something we are talking just because why that you got here a supply and demand zone guys look at it from here last time it fell down down. now from here we touch it again now there is no power to break it down it's showing it's going upwards guys but i told you today is friday guys and it's the last day of 2022 remember that is the last day of 2022 i'm not talking about christmas or new year or whatever me i'm talking here about the last day of yearly trading which meant saturday and sunday in the stock in the forex there is no trading so the market is going to open till monday so all those days they are the close the yearly close is today guys make a close i adopt those things me i'm telling you guys now let's see our indicators guys what the same for pictures to be more clear to you our indicator as you see it guys it's inter here at the oversold area now you got here a price action if everything went how else we accept it you need to enter long guys if it doesn't there is no entry long yet there is no entry long yet not just to watch my video and go now open a buy order no you need even you to do some more me that giving people free information i'll finish from it me i give you the analysis but you, you need to do some work not just you you will you want someone to put food in your mouth everything is too clear now let's go into see the nasdaq 100 guys what it's saying for pictures it'll be more clear to you so it's going there 
the Nasdaq 100 also we enter short from here from that level also we enter short guys it came down to that supply and demand zone here we're protecting ourselves here down now what shall we do now here that you got any price action here indicating the market is going to reverse no my friend we don't got nothing here indicating the market is going to reverse can make a small channel like that yes maybe you can make it like that but the, even that one is not a price action guys everything is too clear the only price action you have here is that one but that one is for long term you got yes the triangle like that but that one is for long term guys if it came and break in here that's another story but tell now you still here in the nasdaq 100 in a downtrend guys there is nothing change yet and the market doesn't give you here a price action indicating the market is going to reverse yes you are in a very 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 stronger supply and demand zone guys look at it first second and now you are in the third time there but there is no price action here indicating the market is going to reverse you need to wait in more guys here in the nasdaq 100 everything is too clear guys so now what should you do here in the nasdaq 100 people they enter with all short from here from that level here over here you check some of the profit you wait and if there is a price action for buy we will close in all the short position if it's not also we continue with it everything is too clear guys let's see our indicator what it's saying to, for pictures it'll be more clear to you so always going down our indicator guys as you see it it's entered here to the oversold area so the people they enter with all short from here protect yourself now try to take some of the profit and now what else we waiting we waiting a price action guys here we don't got any price action yet so when the price action came then also we're looking for a buy opportunity at this time there is nothing new guys also we still in a downtrend and i'll show you even that one in the last video i told you look at it it give you here low now it give you here a high maybe from here it's going to fall down to give you another low guys so the last defense they got is that place here and today as i said it in the sp500 i will repeat it even here today is the last day day of the yearly trading or the year of trading because all the brokers they are going to close today guys so be be very 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 careful guys don't leave orders open if you are not protecting yourself very 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 well guys remember that now let's go into the dxy guys to see what the us dollar doing today so let's go in there here we are guys in the dxy or us dollar index here that one yesterday it's breaking here that triangle we used to have here it's being broken here in that level here because also we used to have here a triangle it gave us here a fake out now it's going back down so that one is a part of trading guys but you if you enter you need to put your stop loss down here now you need to see if that one is going to break that level here so that one guys as we said if you enter long from that place here sorry let me show it to you if you enter long from that place here you're going to put stop loss of you down here so now it's very close to hit it and that's a part of trading guys and here now look at it here it tried to give you here like a triangle like that so now you need to make a close eye if it's going to break long lower here if it's break lower here you can enter even short guys because that level here is very very stronger level and me what me i told you in the daily guys let's go to the daily to show you something i said it before in the daily i told you it's going to go tail here tail 102 yes now it's showing here a sideways market but it's going to fall down down till here guys and us dollar is very 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 slow guys you need to remember that it's going now to the four hours so now what's going to happen guys you are in a sideways market like that as you see it there is nothing new but you you make it like that guys look with me like that and like that you wait and if the, it's breaking down you enter short if it's breaking higher here you enter long turn up there is no break guys so we need to wait in let's see our indicator what it's saying guys our indicator guys as you see it will be in here at the oversold area for long now channel there is no break up that way also we're still waiting guys we don't got nothing here that channel is being broken here now maybe from here as you see it maybe from here now it's going up it's going to fall down to touch it like that and it's going to give us another high that's another story maybe it's going to come and to break for us that last high here that's another story but now me personally i don't open any trade now those days because i'm waiting the new year to finish because me i've been in the new year and i know what it meant the new year in trading guys you don't need to be there that way me i don't open any trade at those days i'm waiting till monday then i'm going to start trading again everything is too clear guys here now is going to see the bitcoin what it's doing today in the four hours so it's going there here we are guys in the bitcoin in the four hours people they've been with me didn't know those things i tell it to you thousands of times
but it's okay i'm going to say this before once we enter short from here here we're protecting ourselves here we're taking some profit and now look where we are we still have some profit now and here it gave us here a head and shoulder like that i told you if it doesn't break the neck line here don't enter long so if someone enter long that's when you are dumb you don't understand english i'm sorry to tell you that but you if you enter long you don't know what i'm saying me i give you the conditions for you to enter long i give you the conditions for you to enter long i told you it needs a candle to cam and to break in here you enter long if it doesn't there is no entry long yet there is any candle cam and breaking there you see it here there is any candle cam here in that zone here and breaking here in that level here no instead the bitcoin is came and touch here look where we are now it fell down down here and what me i told you about that level here i told you now the bitcoin is giving us here like a flag guys look at it now you got here a flag you see it or not you just close it here not a flag now if that one came and break in here you enter short and what me i told you about that i told you it's going to break till next week because today is going to expire the options and those people of the options what they saying majority of them what they saying they saying bitcoin it will not break lower than 16500 where we are today now now at this moment when i'm registering 16600 so those people they're making money and in the top they said 17500 in the top they are in free profit now those ones down it will not close 16500 now is it 16100 yes it's still the whole day but even if it close 16500 one they're making profit because the strike price of them is 16500 if it close here 16500 one they're making profit so those people they know what they're doing that's why me i follow them because those ones they are professional people that's the job of them and i told you is going to break down here till monday and next week and that's what it's showing guys also we are down here in that level now saturday and sunday there is no big volume it's going to stay sideways here then monday you're going to see it breaking down or maybe it's going to go back up because if it's breaking down here you are going to 10k 100 you are going to 10k and i'll show you all those things i told you we got here a head and shoulder here if that one came and breaking down here we are going to 10k 100 guys everything is too clear so now what should you do here in the bitcoin there is nothing to do now people they enter short with us we enter from here now also we are in very nice profit and we are relaxing now we waiting what's going to happen if you want to enter short now you it's too too late now to enter short everything Think it's too clear now let's go into our indicators guys what they say for picture to be more clear to you so let's go in there that one here as you see it it give us here that trend line here now and in that level now where we are now look where we are you remember that level or no Also, we are in it again here and that level it's been reacting like a very stronger support it's getting broke here now we go back to it guys here when we go back to it now either from here we're going to fall down down or from here it's going to go back up to touch that trend line here then after that it's going to fall down again also we don't care what's going to happen guys also we got a clear picture here all controlling here is the best there is no bulls controlling here so also we are in a downtrend guys that's it and we got here now a trend line when we should enter long till the break happen here if it doesn't break there is also we're still in a downtrend everything is too clear let's go to see our other indicator what it's saying guys so it's going there that one here also we enter short because we used to be here at the overbought area we used to have here a price action like that when it's breaking here we enter short yes or no now here it's touching the oversold area should we enter long now no my friend we don't got any long here it's need to give us here a price action indicating the market is going to reverse and another thing here look with me here and here guys you got here a divergence yes or no and i told you yesterday about something very important here i told you, you used to have here a up channel that up channel what happened to it now it's getting broke guys i show you all that yesterday and now when it's getting broke what's, what happened to it here it's coming back to touch it up now if it came and breaking that last low here we are going to down here guys to 15k that's why also we're still holding our short position look with me here i'm going to show it to you look with me here in that place what's happening there everything is too clear guys now it's going to 30 minutes to see what the bitcoin doing right now in 30 minutes so it's going there here we are in 30 minutes people they've been with us here in 30 minutes also we enter a short position from here guys yes or no we make like that we said we got here up channel when it's breaking here we enter long we put stop loose down here it came and hit it yes or no then me i told you in the last video like that we got here a, a down channel like that i told you if it came a break in here you enter long did it break no my friend it came to it now it's showing it's going to fall down more 
And look with me here, very, very, very close here. Look at that level here where you are here. And that one down here. Look that one here. He break that level here. Now it go back to it here. Now either from here is going to fall down to break here. That's meant to break that level here. Or from here we are going to go higher. And we're going to break that level upward. Because a level when it's getting broke. That level here when it's getting broke. Is a support getting broke. What's going to happen to it? It's going to become a resistance. So now here let's see if it's going to react like a resistance or no guys everything is too clear let's see our indicator guys what it's saying so it's going there our indicator guys as you see it it's being here at the oversold area now it's going up yes or no and here it gave us here a small price action small head and shoulder that one for scalpers that way me i told you you don't need to line down only on me you draw here a head and shoulder it's breaking here now you are in profit and you're still waiting to go and up when it's going to touch here the overbought area here in the, our indicator you check profit everything is too clear guys so that's it for that video guys see you after the daily candle finish it bye for now guys